Welcome to PC Mac. Today I'm going to install Plex Media Server on Docker and we have installed Docker on Open Media Vault 4. And for this project I'm using Raspberry Pi 4 Model B. So let's do it. Let me just take you directly to my open media world screen and here we have our docker as you can see I have selected docker from here and the interface is something like this now what you need to do is you need to just click here and look for Plex once you type it it will search all the repositories and it will give you the options like Plex INC PMC Docker or this one if you want to do that so it will give you all these plugins available inside Docker so we'll go with this one Linux Server Plex you just need to click on it and it will select here under the repository section and you need to click on start and it will start downloading the repository on our Docker it will take a moment to download the image so depending upon your internet speed and you can see the pull is complete we just need to wait for like one more minute and then it will be done now once the download is complete we need to configure our Plex Media Server image so how we can do that I'll show you so the pull is complete now what we need to do is just click on close and you can see the image right here the repository right here it will be available for us in a moment now you can see Linux server latest uh, four days ago this image is updated if you want to see the information about this repository what you need to do is just click on info and it will directly take you to the page on hub.docker.com Linux server plex and from here you can check all the information about this repository as you can see and from here you can check whether it's available for Raspberry Pi or not as you can see ARM64 so it can be easily run on a Raspberry Pi and this image is very much compatible with our Raspberry Pi 4 what we need to do is just we need to move down and you can see the parameters here what we need here we need net host and PUID, PGID and these volumes like config, TV, movie, transcode. So we need to do these folders here. So what we need to do is we just need to open our SSH and log into our open media vault. So first of all to find out the PUID and PGID what we need to do is just type ID here and hit enter and you can see UID and GID so you just need to put P in front of it and you will get the information PUID and PGID so the numbers are 00. zero. Now we'll go back to our docker right here and from here we just need to click on run image and when we come uh, when we click on run image it will give us uh, this option what we need to do is first of all let's just name it as plex then we need to always select restart always now these two things are done now we can see from here that we require net host so we need to change it to host and all the information will be done automatically now what you need to do is you need to do PUID and we need to put 0 and then click on plus then PGID and then we need to put 0 again and then plus so these things are done as you can see from here we have PUID that is 0 and GID 0 now we need to set the volumes and bind mounts so from here we can check that we require config TV movies and transcode so what we need to do is just we need to press the forward slash and it will give the important folders like we need to select config and from here we need to select the path the host path 
so what i did i create a folder in our samba with the name docker and inside it we create a folder with the name plex and this folder is empty so let's just minimize it and from here we'll select this option so this is a shared folder through samba server we need to look for shared folder and then we need to click on docker and then we need to select plex this is the path for our plex server so we need to click on ok and this is done so we need to click on plus and again we need to just press the forward slash and you can see transcode here and then we can just again go down and from here we need to select again the plex folder and ok and then add now i'm not setting up these folders tv or movies if you want you can just go ahead and create these folder so i'll i'll show you how you can do that I just open the same folder again let's just refresh it and create two more folders here tv and movies so we can put our tv shows here and movies in this folder so these two folders are also here let's just go ahead and uh, make the path as well let's just do that so tv and the path is from here shared folder docker plex and from here just select tv okay and add it and then same goes with movies and i'll do the path and this is also done just click on plus now everything is done here what you need to do is just click on save to save the container when we click on save it will save all the information and it says it the state is running let's just click on it and click on start now we have successfully installed plex on our docker once the application set up what we need to do is we need to type our ip address that's the ip address of our raspberry pi and we need to put a colon then 32400 forward slash web so let's just go ahead and copy it and put the ip address that is 192.168.1.12 in my case and then just put a colon and the web address that is 32400 forward slash web let's just hit enter and as you can see the plex is running now you just need to log in with the account that you want to log in with and then you need to connect the same account on your other devices let me just go ahead and sign in and from here we just need to select our media library let's just close the plex pass and type the name let's name it as pc mac and then uncheck this option allow me to access my media outside my home next now we need to select the media library as i already did that now you can add library from here you can select the path that you given inside the docker i click on add library click on movies and then just click on next it will ask you to the to select the media folder what you need to do is just click on movies or tv or you can uh, we have created the tv and movies folder so just select movies and add and then add library this will be it you can select the tv folder as well tv shows and just click on tv and add add to library and then next and done So this is the way you can configure the Plex server on Docker and these are installed on Open Media Vault. So guys that's it from my end. If you like my work please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Share this video with your family and friends. Thank you for watching. Bye bye. Take care. Have a nice day.